Prince William didn't want to go there when his brother Harry returned to UK soil, but his wife Kate's diplomacy played a key role in ensuring the visit ran smoothly, a close friend of the royals has claimed. The Duke of Sussex, 37, stepped back from royal duties along with his wife Meghan Markle, 40, in 2020. The couple then moved to the US. They live in Montecito, California with their children Archie, 2, and 6-month-old Lilibet. Following their departure, the Sussexes have not returned to the UK as a family of four. Instead, Harry has made the trip to British soil alone on two occasions. The Duke first returned to the UK in April following the death of Prince Philip. Amid the ongoing Covid pandemic, Harry followed strict guidance at the time to attend his grandfather's funeral, along with other members of the royal family, within the grounds of Windsor Castle. He later returned to the US to reunite with his family, before heading to the UK again in July. This visit, to unveil a statue of Diana at Kensington Palace, was also the second time Harry reunited with his brother William, 39, since moving across the pond. The statue shows the Princess of Wales, who died in 1997, surrounded by children with her arms outstretched. It is situated in the sunken garden of Kensington Palace, known to be their mother's favourite spot. The small event, as Kensington Palace described it, was attended only by the brothers, Diana's siblings, sculptor Ian Rank Broadley, garden designer Pip Morrison, and those involved in the creation of the statue. However, despite not being present at the event, the Duchess of Cambridge played an integral role in ensuring things ran smoothly during Harry's return visit to the UK, a friend of the couple has claimed. A close friend has told Sunday Times royal editor Royal Nicar, William was still furious. He had taken the view that he'd only give so much. He just didn't want to go there, with Harry. While an aide additionally claimed, Catherine, was amazing behind the scenes when Harry came. The Duke of Cambridge's fury followed Harry and Meghan's tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, it is suggested. During a two-hour TV special that aired in March last year, the couple made a series of seismic claims about their time as senior royals. The Duke of Sussex admitted his relationships with his brother, and his father, Prince Charles, had become strained following his step away. Harry and Meghan explained how they felt trapped in the family. They also alleged there were several concerns and conversations about how dark son Archie's skin would be. In the aftermath, Buckingham Palace released a statement reading, The whole family is saddened to learn the full extent of how challenging the last few years have been for Harry and Meghan. It added while some recollections may vary, the issues mentioned would be addressed by the family privately.